So, hello friends. So this is one of the unpacking videos for the Beamer. And uh, it comes in this nice box. And in the box is the Beamer with the bracelet. The bracelet you can take off with this tool here. Very simple. And then uh, we also have the, the audio cable and the charge cable and then we have this cable is here the connection for the ear sensor and here we have the ear sensor so that's all part of this this box now when you take the beamer out first to one thing you press both buttons a little longer until all the the um, green and yellow come on if you keep too long it will switch off again you know if you if you press again it switches off again so you have to press both until all are on and then you release and then you can also uh, the first thing you will do is to press quickly again so you see the upper four uh, green LEDs come on which means it's almost fully charged if all five are on it's perfect if only two come on uh, the first thing you should do is connect this with this cable to a USB uh, port and then the upper white a white LED comes on if, if it's being charged and this white LED comes off once it's finished and completely charged so then the, the first thing I would suggest to you download the Beamer application uh, either on the Google Play or on the App Store and uh, when you have this the first thing is erase the memory because I don't know what what's there from the factory you want to have a clear uh, clear device so you just um, use the audio cable plug this in and connect it to the audio port so before you just press the erase button you have to uh, press the lower button here uh, a few seconds until all the yellow come on as you see and then you press erase you can see now here uh, the erase button becomes uh, red and uh, then the the memory is erased so this takes a little longer because it's a, a very different systems than what you know with flash drives um, these yellow li lights will be blinking for about 40 seconds and then uh, when this is done any audio signal that you connect uh, with the same cable will be automatically recorded so you can use of course your core system generate frequencies you can use uh, there's numerous apps now on uh, Google Play and the App Store for frequency generation they are free uh, they're just simple frequency generators uh, so you can use those um, you can um, upload any music so when you when you have any music that you think is a healing music healing has has lots of healing potential you just run it and connect the audio cable to the headphone input or output of your of your um, uh, player whatever it is and then it will automatically record now you see it has stopped blinking now uh, because this is the first time when you unpack it we want to reset all the, the, the settings we press again until all the yellow lights come on okay and now you press the reset button yes so now you see here the, the yellow lights show that it's receiving the signal and resetting all uh, all the information to the factory default okay and now anything that you apply as I said will be recorded 
So for example, here is a small little uh, frequency generator in this application, we've included it. So you can put here the frequency 1 and a frequency 2 and you can say in what duration they should alternate. You can also just use one frequency. So if I now press this button, then the Beamer automatically recognizes it's now getting a signal that it should record and you see here um, uh, it's it's uh, now recording as long as the the green buttons are here the green LED come on and I can switch this off any time now for example and it will still look for more signal because you can also record pauses pauses up to 30 seconds because I know and the Tao knows Doing by not doing is the most potential of all doings. So it's not only frequencies that's healing, but also intermission, the pause between frequencies. This is completely unknown really in, the, in this world of acting and doing, but we can do this here also. So you can, uh, you can also, whenever you apply frequencies, you can intentionally in include pauses and pauses up to 30 seconds and uh, then when the 30 seconds it doesn't recognize any more signal it switches off and the, and the recording is done you can record up to eight minutes but if you record less it will just when you run it uh, just repeat every loop again and again as long as the core uh, as long as the system is on you see always the green uh, led coming on it shows you that the, the LED the BMI is on, it switches on every 10 seconds. And now you see we have here 1 hertz alternating with uh, what we have put in here, eight, 800 hertz. So it's all up to you. You can put this here in or use any frequency generator of your choice or the core system or music. And so that's the basic process of setting up the basics and then from there you have a lots of possibilities, you can change the amplitude, you can change the mode, you can change the, the what you do on the different channels, uh, you can uh, enable if you want tens only or infrared or visible LED or pulse magnetic frequency or if you want to run a frequency generator uh, on each of those channels separately and then we have different programs so you have lo lots of possibilities. Be patient with yourself. These are the first three steps you have to take and then you have, you're good for a long time with good results. So thank you for your attention.